protection wise? What else can you guys do to help that? Um, you know, I think they, the offensive line played played well today. Um, you know, we, we weren't in many empty empty uh, formations, um, so you know that that helped us. Um, yeah, I mean, I think it just comes down to um, you know, it's just executing the game plan, which I think our offensive line did a good job of, uh, you know, protectionally today. What would you point to as just not being able to finish those drives? Uh, you know, with touchdowns. Yeah, um, you know, we just need to make make a couple more plays. Um, and I think that's what comes down to it. We, we've stopped ourselves from scoring. How do you feel physically? Looked like you took some pretty vicious hits out there. Yeah, um, you know, it's football. Uh, you know, it's part of the game. So, uh, you know, the coaches do a good job of stressing us, you know, taking care of our bodies. So, um, you know, I do everything I can as far as, uh, you know, working with the trainers, getting treatments, things like that to, to make sure I'm healthy. What is causing the run game to struggle in the last two weeks? Can you repeat that? What's, what's causing the run game to struggle? In the last two weeks, um, you know, I think we've put ourselves in, in positions to, um, you know, one not run the ball as much. Um, you know, I think we we're we we're the last two games we've been heavy pass. Um, you know, we put ourselves in those positions. So, um, you know, I think statistically that can get um, you know, maybe a little skewed because of the, the amount of times that we're running the ball, um, you know, and passing the ball. How frustrating is it when you aren't finishing drives, and does that force you to press maybe as the game goes on in your mind? Um, you know, I don't think it forces forces me to press. Um, you know, we just feel confident with our game plan. You know, follow the game plan. Um, you know, we feel confident that uh, you know the more times we're down there, the more we just stick with what we know and, and what's been successful getting us down into the red zone. Um, you know, it'll finally break through the fourth. And as a senior guy who's been around and, and been through bumps on the road like this before, what's key to weathering these little storms throughout a season? What you tell some of the younger guys you haven't been in this kind of situation? Uh, it always passes. Um, you know, as long as we continue to, to, to you know put our nose to the grindstone and, and you know do what we need to do on a daily basis, you know it's going to pass. We're going to we're going to get through this. We're going to um, you know come out the other side of the tunnel. Um, you know, so just making sure that everybody uh, believes in that message and you know is working towards it. About that pass to, to Brandon for the touchdown. Mm -hmm. What did you see on that play? And you really you gave him a shot, but he made a pretty good catch on it. Yeah. Um, you know. They had been disguising some coverages. I thought that I was getting man coverage over to, over to that side. Um, you know, they ended up playing cover three, but um, you know, Brandon. I like Brandon against you know anybody really. Um, you know, I'm going to give him a chance to go make a play, and, and um, you know, he did a great job. He 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 bailed me out on that one. He he went up and got that 50-50 ball for me. Take two more for me. How successful do you think you can be on a pass-heavy game plan, considering the last two weeks? That you not been able to run the ball. You said it's a passive game plan, but is that a recipe for success in your opinion? Um, you know, we always strive to, to be as balanced as possible. Is it hard for the offensive line to be consistent with all the bodies that are going in and out? Um, you know, I, I don't think so. I think all of the guys that we put in the game are, are ready to play. Um, you know, Coach, o, Co or excuse me, Coach Balsack does a great job at, at getting those guys ready to play, and, and I think mentally, all those guys know that that. Uh, you know, they have the possibility to be in the game, and, and they've done a great job of preparing. TV broadcast said looked like you injured your hand. You were kind of throwing some things off. Anything happened there? Uh, no, it's, it's fine. <laughs>